Let me bring you some important words, so listen, and listen good. In a world filled with uncertainties, it's easy to be consumed by worry and anxiety. The weight of responsibilities, the fear of the unknown, and the trials we face can all threaten to overwhelm us. But in those moments, I implore you to remember this powerful truth. Be anxious for nothing and trust God. Philippians 4 verses 6 to 7 offers us a timeless reminder. Be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication. With thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. These words serve as a beacon of hope, guiding us through the storms of life. To be anxious for nothing does not mean suppressing our concerns or dismissing the very real challenges we face. Rather, it invites us to take our worries to God in prayer. It encourages us to approach the throne of grace with confidence, knowing that our Heavenly Father hears our cries and cares deeply for us. Consider the lilies of the field and the birds of the air, as Jesus reminds us in Matthew 6, verses 26 to 28. They neither toil nor worry, yet they are cared for by the Creator of the universe. How much more, then, does He care for us? his beloved children? Let us rest in the assurance that we are in the hands of a God who is intimately acquainted with our every need. The story of David and Goliath stands as a testament to the power of trust in the face of seemingly insurmountable odds. David, a young shepherd boy, faced a giant who struck fear into the hearts of seasoned warriors. Yet, he trusted in the God who had delivered him from the paw of the lion and the bear. With a sling and a stone, he overcame the giant, showing us that with God, all things are possible. Trusting God does not mean we will be shielded from difficulties, but it does mean we can face them with unwavering confidence. In moments of adversity, we can lean on the promise of Romans 8 verse 28 knowing that God works all things together for the good of those who love Him. Yet, this trust requires action on our part. It calls us to surrender our fears, doubts, and need for control. It invites us to release the burdens we carry and place them in God's capable hands. It means acknowledging that His ways are higher, His wisdom is infinite, and His love is boundless. In times of stillness, when the world grows quiet, we have the opportunity to seek God's presence through prayer and meditation. It is in these sacred moments that we can hear His gentle whispers of guidance and feel the reassurance of His embrace. By intentionally setting aside time to commune with God, we open ourselves to His leading and direction. Dear friends, let us take to heart the words of Proverbs 3 verses 5 and 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him, and He shall direct your paths. In the midst of life's trials and tribulations, may we be steadfast in our trust in God knowing that He is faithful to lead us through every season of life. As we journey forward, may we be anxious for nothing, but in everything, by prayer and supplication, let our requests be made known to God. May His peace, which surpasses all understanding, guard our hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. May we trust God with unwavering faith, knowing that He is with us. He is for us, and He will never leave us nor forsake us. Now let us pray. Heavenly Father, as we gather before You, our hearts are filled with a mixture of gratitude, hope, and, at times, anxiety. 
in a world that seems to constantly change, where uncertainties abound, we find solace in the truth that you are our unchanging, unwavering rock. Today, we come before you, seeking to be anxious for nothing and to trust you with every aspect of our lives. Lord, your word reminds us that in all things, through prayer and supplication, we can bring our concerns before you in Philippians 4 verse 6. You are not a distant God, but a loving Father who longs to hear from his children. You invite us to approach your throne of grace with confidence, knowing that you hear us and that you care deeply for our well-being. The cares of this world may press upon us, threatening to overwhelm our hearts and minds. Yet, in those moments, we remember the promise of your peace, a peace that surpasses all human understanding. It is a peace that guards our hearts and minds, a peace that transcends circumstances and provides a sanctuary for our souls. Lord, we reflect on the story of Elijah, a prophet who faced tremendous trials and challenges. In moments of despair, when he believed he was alone, you revealed yourself to him in a gentle whisper. In our own moments of quietness, we seek your presence, knowing that in the stillness, we can hear your gentle whispers of guidance and feel the reassurance of your embrace. The world around us may be filled with uncertainties, but we find comfort in the unchanging nature of your character. You are the same yesterday, today, and forever. Your love for us is steadfast. Your faithfulness never wavers, and your promises are sure. In moments of doubt, Lord, help us to lean not on our own understanding, but to trust in you with all our hearts. It requires surrendering our fears, our worries, and our need for control. It means acknowledging that your ways are higher than our ways. Your wisdom is infinite and your love is boundless. We find inspiration in the life of Daniel, a man who faced lions in a den, but trusted in you with unwavering faith. He knew that you were the God who delivered, the God who protected, and the God who had a plan far greater than any circumstance he faced. May we too trust in you, knowing that you are our protector, our refuge, and our ever-present help in times of trouble. Lord, as we journey forward, may we carry with us the assurance that we serve a God who is in control. May we be anxious for nothing, but in everything. May we bring our requests before you, knowing that you are faithful to hear and to respond. We place our trust in you, Lord, knowing that you hold our lives in the palm of your hand. May this trust be a source of comfort, strength, and assurance as we navigate the complexities of life. May it be a beacon of hope in moments of darkness, a steadfast anchor in times of storm. Thank you, Lord, for being our rock, our refuge, and our ever-present help. May we walk forward with confidence, knowing that we are held by the one who is able to do immeasurably more than all we ask or imagine. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.